Joe B, a movie and a bottle of wine. Hey everybody, it's Joe B and Matt and the cat. Um, the cat was here earlier. We went over to Gabe's because they reopened and I got some blinky ball toys for the cat. These things are awesome. I mean, I'm intrigued by them. We got up to the register to leave and I saw these and I had to buy all of them on the rack. I mean, who could not enjoy this? The cat is mesmerized. That's pretty cool. Sylvester? 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 He doesn't look so good. Look at his eyes. Look at his eyes. Kitty, kitty. Kitty, kitty. Hello. Hello. Sylvester. Sylvester. <laughs> I like that. Um, we bought Matt and I some Almond Joys. I'm a big fan of Almond Joys. They remind me of my mom, but Matt, Matt's not a big fan. Yeah, yeah. I can take it or leave it. Take it or leave it. I, I love them. Almond Joys got nuts. Now don't be Sometimes you feel like a... Sometimes you... I grabbed them. They also had, um, what, what were those uh, Rice Krispie Oh, they had like a rice crisp, white, chocolate. white chocolate covered. Oh, milk. I'm so glad we didn't buy them because I'd be eating them too. Look, <laughs> Blinky Ball goes off. Um, I, got, I had some Locos tonight, the black ones, because it matches my shirt. Matt uh, it was looking at my shirt earlier. It glows in the dark. Yep. Green Lantern <laughs> shirt glows in the dark. Yep. We had some wine we got in at Costco, and I waited patiently for the coupon to take effect. It took $5.10 off, so the uppercut is only like 7 bucks a bottle, 7 something a bottle. Sweet. We got it last year, and we got a coupon on it, and I waited patiently, and the coupon hit, and I bought a 12-pack. Sweet. That's when a Cabernet Sauvignon? Hits, Sauvignon? Ca Cabernet Ca Sauvignon, for Excellent. sure. Excellent. Excellent. Delicioso. I can't say enough good about it. You, Matt? Nope. Yeah. Uppercut! Uppercut! <laughs> That's what it feels like in the morning. Don't drink a whole bottle of it. <laughs> um, we watched a lot of movies. Um, Matt and I, we haven't seen you in two weeks. And I'll tell you what happened. The first week, I was lazy as hell. You were stoned. Because... Everything that I watched sucked, and I just didn't even want to tell you how much it sucked, so I didn't even want to do a show. And then the next week, Matt and I were both lazy at the same time, so now we're back. And I got a gang of stuff, but I, I'm telling you, I'm going to leave the crappers out. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell right. you about the good stuff. All right, just do the creme de la creme. All right, so Top notch. Glass was good. I got to the end, and um, I watched it twice, and I got a little confused in the end. I was sad to see how it ended. Um, watch that if you want. I, I, you know, I pregame for all of it, and I, I, in the end, Glass, okay. So, uh, Nancy Drew. Nancy Drew was adorable. The girl that played Nancy Drew was so cute. The story was good. It was so genuine and innocent and her and her little friends and the fun that they had and the mayhem, it was, it was very cute. Uh, second act I watched with J-Lo. I, I think her daughter was Vanessa Hudgens. Um, it, she was uh, going out into the business world. It was it was a very good women's empowerment kind of movie. I, second act, J Lo. Definitely watch it. Um, Holmes and Watson. It had Will Ferrell in it, and I can't think of the other guys. John C. Riley. Thank you, Matt. Yep. I, I enjoyed both of them together. They were in Brothers together. It, it was funny to watch them interact with each other. Uh, the Man Who Killed Hitler and Then the Bigfoot. And it was Sam Elliott. It took 12 years to make this movie. But it started out where he killed Hitler in the beginning, and then he went on when he got older to kill the Bigfoot. Good story. Sam Elliott. I mean, what could Sam Elliott be bad in? <laughs> um... We watched Tonight Isn't It Romantic. It had Rebel Wilson in it. She was from Pitch Perfect, all the Pitch Perfects. I love her. She was such a good member of Pitch Perfect. And she was really cute in this movie. She bumped her head, and she went into an alternate reality. 
and it was really cute. It was really cute. And she was dying to get back to reality because she was so tired of the alternate reality. <laughs> um, I, I was really happy to report that I got to watch On the Basis of Sex. I've been going on and on and on about the Ruth Bader Ginsburg movie. I've been dying to see it because I love that sketch on Saturday Night Live. And in the very end of the movie, the original Ruth Bader Ginsburg walks up the steps uh, going into uh, the big building of law. <laughs> what, what is it? The Supreme it? Court building. Okay. Yeah. Oh, my God. It was so cute to see her marching up there in her sensible shoes and her little suit. And, and seeing the girl that played her throughout the movie, it was really cute. On the basis of sex. And her husband was this little hammer guy. Oh, wow. I couldn't... He could hammer. Wow. He was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> um, if you want to watch a movie and you want to cry, and you like the movie A Dog's Purpose, and you cried and cried and cried when the dog came back every time when he was killed, and oh, oh. It, this tissue right here caught all the tears from this movie, A Dog's Way Home. Oh, no. I could not stop crying, y'all. Oh, no. And it, I went through several snot rags, but this was my tears. <laughs> this was collected all of my tears. The, the, it was an epic journey of this dog getting back home to his owner. And it, it was done, done from a dog's point of view and a, a, a an innocent dog's point of view. A dog doesn't understand deceit and, and all these awful things that go on around it. So, um, oh, oh, I couldn't say enough good. Uh, the, the dog's purpose and, and, and a dog's way home. If you want to cry, you get a box of tissues and you sit down and you watch this movie, but the story is so heart-touching and good. Okay, um, let's see. There were some previews that I wanted to get to. Um, the Upside is a story with Kevin Hart, and I can't think of the guy's name. He was the dad in one of those shows, and he's a paraplegic. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And Kevin yeah, Hart yeah, takes yeah. care of him. Mm -hmm. Yes. It, that looks like it's going to be such a good story, The Upside. Um, I've already spoken of Serenity. It has Diane Lane, Anne Hathaway, and Matthew McConaughey in it. Yeah where he takes uh, her husband out to sea and kills him uh, because she wants to do away with him. So I'm curious to see that one. Um, did, and, I, and I mentioned um, Welcome to Marwin with Steve Carell. Yes. Did I not mention no, that? No, you didn't mention that. Yeah. <clears throat> that was the cutest thing ever. Yeah. To watch those people transition from being the dolls to being people and the little village that he built and then he would wear high-heeled shoes. He had a collection of high-heeled shoes in his closet, and his friend would bring him shoes. He, she brought him a pair of espadrilles. But he had a closet full of shoes. It was so cute. And he had high-heeled shoes for the doll that was him. It was so cute, y'all. I'm telling you. Welcome to Marwin. Um, Marwin had to do with his name was Mark, and his girlfriend's name was Wendy. So it was M-A-R-W-E-N, Marwin. Cute story. Uh, let's see. And another one that I want to watch as far as the previews go is uh, MIB International. There's going to be another Men in Black, y'all. Cool. It's going to be really cute. It's going to have a chick in it. So that's going to be different. I can't wait to see that. I hope y'all are as excited about mm -hmm. it as I am. <laughs> I think that's everything. Everything okay. except for Matt Pat coming I'm in. Come in here while the camera is still recording. He I'm, set off the balls. I'm setting off the, the balls. <laughs> These things are pretty. They look cool in the car when it was really dark. They, wouldn't stop, up. they wouldn't stop shaking up and down. <laughs> so, anyways, um, it's not quite Easter yet. So, we're in the middle of April. We were gone for two weeks. So, Missed April Fools, I guess. Oh, and tax day. That's coming. Shoot. <laughs> Hope you all taxes have been paid or Matt took you got care an of me. extension or Matt something took like care that. Of me. So. He's my hero. All right. <laughs> <laughs> the IRS, look out, run! Okay. <laughs> I think 
we're, we're done. So I'm going to say good night. Thanks for watching. Enjoy some of these movies. Enjoy some Almond Joys. Enjoy some wine. Enjoy some Loco. Enjoy some Joby. Enjoy some cat who's over there still in the kitchen running around. Bye, everybody. Bye, everybody. Oh, oh no falling. I'm falling off the snow. No I'm falling. I don't I'm falling. know my homeowners covers that. <laughs> Thank you for watching Joby, a movie and a bottle of wine. And her husband was this little hammer guy. Wow. I couldn't see. He could hammer. Wow.